Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Code Primate. This is Spooky's Jump Scare Mansion. Shut up and get it done. We have, uh, we're at room 900. If you've not been following the series, this is actually pretty scary, and I didn't realize it was going to be this scary, but that's not the point. <laughs> we have 100 levels to go. And they, they are 100 rooms, and they go fast. They're really fast, so. Sorry for the loud noises. It's to in, in induce the scare, the fear. Here we go. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Okay, where are we? What is that? Okay, you know what? Don't care. Let's just go. We're just gonna run it out. 100 rooms. Here we go. Last episode. Nothing, nothing to see. Nothing to do. Just straight through. Why is it getting the sound like that? Why is it so scary? Does does it look different today? Ninety rooms left. What is this? Oh. Research report number one. Oh, it's a fountain. Research report number one. More whales are being shipped to the facility tomorrow. One for a health inspection and two that are already dead for autopsy. More and more beached whales keep appearing around those islands and I still can't find what is causing it. Okay. Broken. We're in we're in nine ten. Report number five, research facility is now in dire need of more engineers. We have a whole block that is flooded and some vital staff are missing. Wait, what was that? Was that just the read from over here? Yeah, it's just read. It's the same one. Hey, buddy. I feel bad for you. You're all locked up and alone. Oh, hey, report. Well, 015D has died much sooner than I expected. I was away on holiday. I regret not being here, but I had estimated it would live much longer. The team that did the autopsy said nothing seemed to be wrong with the lungs, but the stomach had circular holes about two feet in diameter all the way through to the outside of the whale. This pretty much confirms that the parasite is the cause of death. Oh, I got a parasite in him. Uh oh, that one's the one's the broken. That one's broken too. And that's the room that doesn't have anything in it. Did we read this one already? Yeah, that's report number one. Let's go over here. Hello. Let's go to the back rooms. Broken. It's too dark to see. Open it. Oh, what's this? Report number two. Well, 014-D has strange small bite marks. They appear from another small mammal, but the strangest thing about them is their placement. They are in even rows around the whale's stomach, about five inch in diameter from the bottom of the stomach lighting. That's what the last one said. Well, 015-A is still alive, but 
gets into fits of thrashing and is surfacing more often than natural. I think it may be a problem with its lungs, but um, I don't have any tools that would allow me to check check it without dying. I will have to allow it to die from whatever is causing it and then do an autopsy. Oh, poor whales. Alright. There we go. Oh, oh, hold on. Hold on. I got a thing stuck in my eye. Oh, yuck. Nasty. Okay, there we go. Okay, cool. Um, excerpt one four one three two and then i watched carelessly as the sea rose above the sky casting wave waving shadows over the world i saw the silhouette of a creature both familiar and forgotten and suddenly i found myself falling upward towards an ocean of darkness okay Okay. Oh, this is the room we were just in. The other one was broken though, right? Yeah, well, too dark to see. That one's broken. So, back to the main room. Shall we open this door? The water is too high. Can we go back this way? Go that way though. Okay. <sighs> oh no. I thought maybe we could break the glass and let the water go lower. No, can't get in there. Nope, can't get in there. Can't hit the desk. Can't hit that. Hmm. Hmm. Oh wait, can I, can I hit the, wait, was it this one? No, it's not this one. Where's the room that has the, uh, the lock on it? Is it the other way? It's the other way. Alright, so through here, and then to the south. Wait, no? Ah, here we go. Is there like a light switch or something? Maybe something I'm missing? Oops, 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 oops. Hmm. No light switch. The water is too high. So how do we get the water down? That's broken. Basically I'm just running in circles at this point. Maybe I had the right idea in breaking the, uh, the glass. Is there anything on the ceiling? What what am I missing?
follow the right. Let's just follow the right, see if there's anything we can do. That's broken. It's too dark to see. Oh, oh, what's this? What's this? Okay, okay, it's a pipe, I see. Does the pipe continue? The pipe does not continue. Oh wait, is that a pipe? No, that's not a pipe. Hmm. Okay. Okay, I can't hit the pipe at all. What about the other side? Is it is there Is there a pipe on the side? There's no pipe. That door's broken. And this door's broken, right? Yeah. Both those doors are broken. To the south of here is notes. Wait. I'm gonna need to memorize that uh, that code, aren't I? Hold up. Over here, this room. Oh, that's the research report. That's report number two. Where's the excerpt? Excerpt. Four one three two. Four one three two. Forty one thirty two. Hmm. Okay, I have a feeling it has something to do with this pipe. Am I just not seeing it? Have I passed something? What is up? Anything in the middle of the room? Nope. The water is too high. Hmm. It sounds scary. It really does. But it's about useless if I can't do something here. Hmm. I really hate trying to like do this stuff and like googling it and not figuring it out for myself. Ooh, that was a new sound. What was that sound? Do I have to read the reports in order, maybe? And that's the only difference that I've seen. Too dark to see. Okay. Well, hold on. Okay, I just read it. And it said that the room with the excerpt in it should have a lantern. So I need to find a lantern. There should be a lantern in here.
I don't see no lantern. After I read it, is there a lantern? I don't see a lantern anywhere. the lantern <laughs> there we go okay there we are all right uh, turn four one three two Ooh -hoo -hoo. all right um I hear a girl or an animal or something singing to me, pleading that I come outside my locked room and let the sweeping waves comfort me. Wait, what? That's not what I wanted. Oh, excuse me. Oh, gosh. That's water pump controls. Pumps have been restarted. Oh, my gosh. Now what? Now what? Sounds like my heartbeat. Do, 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 do. All right, that's, that's still broken. That's still broken. Oh, these have stopped. Let's go look at the the whale. Is the whale okay? No. All right. Whale's gone. Whale's like I'm out. But now. Make sure I didn't miss anything in there. Okay. Oof. The lantern what? Why do I feel broken? Open. There's a key. I got a key. I don't know what kind of key it is. Broken. I should look around first. Oh, okay. Um, hello? Oh, oh, no. No, no, no. Mm -mm. Uh uh. No. <sighs> Why? I'm like, it was a mermaid. Mermaids aren't evil. Run, run, run. I can't tell where she's at. <laughs> that is horrible. I have to, I have to stay out of the water. Is it like a cu cumulative? Oh, is she over there? Oh yeah, she's she's like following. She's not fast though. Okay, okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. We're at nine twelve. Okay, these these aren't bad. I thought I thought this was gonna be a challenge. Psh, psh. Uh oh, I think I went to the wrong side. What? What? I'm not. I'm not. I'm on the thing. <sighs> okay, she's right there. So I need to run to that one. Can I? Can I run it out? Can I run it? <sighs> <sighs> 
back. Wee. Oh my gosh. Oh no, I ran out. Oh man. I ran out of stamina. Mermaids aren't evil! Stay back, Ariel. Little mermaid. Oh, where's Sebastian? Oh, come on. Go. Under the sea. Under the sea. We're at 916. We Open the door. Let's go. New stamina. New place. Go across this way. Do I need to go that way? I don't know. Wee! Got it. I did start recording again, right? Okay, yeah, we're good. We're good. I'm like, that would suck if I had forgotten to start recording after I went and searched it. swim when I'm off the boxes? Doesn't seem like a a good ability for some reason. Ooh, I thought I didn't hit the box. Or the, the door. The door. Not the box. The door. Seventy-nine more rooms. Run it out. You can see me go running, running. I believe we go running. Oh, run, Forrest, run! My dad said that in one of the comments the other day. <laughs> and yes, for everybody who was asking, my dad isn't in the comments down below. And yes, he does watch my videos. It was his birthday the other day. Well. October 31st is his birthday, but we uh, we celebrated it this weekend. Took him out. We went to Mexican Villa. You know the place where we got the hot sauce? That place. Yum. They have this thing called the Sancho Enchilada style. Get the full plate if you ever go. Oh, I was worried that she wasn't chasing me anymore. Can we go this way? Oh, why not? I guess it doesn't run. Ah, oh, you again. All right, fine. If it's not mermaids, it's it's floating girls. And if it's not floating girls, it's some spider. Dude, we haven't seen the spider in a while. Or the centip centipede? Millipede? I guess it's neither of those. It's a specimen, but... 928. 929. 930. Oh, <laughs> you! Oh, little stinker! Got me! Oh, I was not expecting that. That's the nine thirty-three. Can we go through this one? Yeah. Why not? Nine thirty-five. We're getting closer. Final episode. This is how we do. 38, 39, 40.
42. 43. Why is it all of a sudden getting eerily creepier? 45. Why do I feel like it's gonna troll me in the last 10 rooms or something like that? Do you, you ever get the chills, like somebody's watching you, and you, you feel like somebody's watching you? 950. 951. We got 48 rooms left. 47. Forty-six. Oh! Centipede! Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh my gosh. Ah! Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. <laughs> I was just talking about you, buddy. Ah. Go, go, go. Sixty. We're so close. <laughs> How many of you freaked out right there? Comment down below. Let me know. <laughs> and sixty-three. And sixty-four. Sixty-five. Sixty-six. Oh, it's this room. Get ready. Get ready for the jump scare. Let's check the note. Yeah. Okay. It's gonna be... No! Oh! No! It didn't... We're gonna have to do it again. Get ready, get ready. What? Okay. Nope. Get ready. And now? Nope. Not this one. This one here. Ready? Ready? No. <sighs> if I keep trying it, does it just not let me through? Ah, there it goes. It's like seven rooms. Wait, what was the point of that? Sixty-eight. Nine sixty-nine. <laughs> Do you know what? I'm gonna drink your cousin. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh my gosh. 970. 970. 71. I'm seeing more and more boxes. Did they move into this this area of the castle or the mansion? 973. 974. Don't go down the long hallway. 975. 975, 976, 977, 978, 979. Should we check the, the cat DOS for the last time? Alright. Access database. Specimen 6. Let's, let's go back through all of them. Why not? Yep, it's the cardboard cutouts, and then it's the, the green dude, booger man, and then it's the guy with the knife. Oh no, it's the centipede. And then the guy with the knife. No, it's the girl. That's the guy with the knife. Yeah. And then the doll guy. 
And what do we have? We have specimen number seven, which is the wall. I don't like the wall, dude. We got that guy. Join us. That thing, he, I don't think you guys have seen him, but, oh, do you remember that? The parasite dude? And then we got the little flying devil dude. The chandelier. Various methods. An old Victorian mansion that seems to build itself around its environment. The specimen sometimes chooses a host to possess and uses them to attack subjects with various means depending on the host's characteristics. Not much is known about the origin of the mansion, but signs occasionally show an early massacre or tragedy has taken place within the mansion, proven very effective, but varies itself too often. Uh, to be reliable method of extraction. So the Victorian mansion that we're in is the uh, the host. It's the last specimen. Ah. Oh. Okay. We remember that room, the one with the chandelier and the stairs. So let's go back. Can we do the modify of the thing? Air. Yeah, it's always an air. Back. And exit the program. Exit the program. Here we go. Alright. 980. 81. 82. 83. 84. 85. See, now this room had torches. That last one that looked like this room didn't have torches on it. 87. 88. Is anybody else, like, super excited right now? <clears throat> 89. 90. Brrr. Got 10 more. 10. 9. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Uh-oh. It's a save point. Why is it... Okay. Why did we get it at 995? I guess that's a good thing. That's good. That's good. So if we die, we only have five rooms to go. There we go. Four. Three. Two. One. You did it. Achievement unlocked. <sighs> Do not enter. Is it just a single, single room? Oh, I knew it wasn't gonna, yeah. Vista Sky Fatal Air, fake sky.
Why? Why? What final test? I did the thousand doors. Okay, here we go. What is this? Okay. You can do that. Uh, I'm, th there's no problem with that. Oh, I can push. Okay, okay. There's no more door counter. Seven three one. That seems significant. I should probably remember that. Seven three one. Okay. Seven three one. Seven three one. Seven three one. What was that? What happened? Okay. Okay. Yes. I'm not quite understanding what this is all about. I can defend against this old house. You seem to think I can defend myself somehow. Can I hit him? I cannot. I can. I don't. I don't know. It's so loud. It's like unbelievably loud. Oh, oh, run, 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 run. Have I gotten hit at all? Hmm. Do I need to make him hit himself? I feel like I feel like I need to make him hit himself somehow. All right, there's. Oh gosh! Oh gosh! All right, those are the fireball thingies, right? Yep, you still miss me. Hmm. Thank goodness for the pause button. I'm going to hit them. All right, I gotta pause it. I gotta pause it. Hold on. It's like way too loud. There you go. There you go. That way it's not as loud. Um. How to defeat the final boss. I am a little lost. How do you fight this man? Here we go. Ending. Spoiler alert. Show it. Okay, wait, hold on. Good ending. If the player gathers less than 20 points from chopping down a specimen with their axe, one point from specimens one, 
Three points for all the other specimens. After the boss battle with specimen nine, the roof collapses on when the battle ends. Okay. What? Okay, I guess just keep swinging. We'll turn it back up, but it's really loud. All right, resume. Come on, life, go back up. Is that actually working? So loud. So wait, does he just need to rest every once in a while? Is that is that what's happening? He came down to the ground for like just a split second earlier. Come on, buddy. Get down here. Come on down. Ugh. Just a bunch of screaming. Come on. Come on down. Come on down. You're lucky I can't jump. Whoa! That hit me pretty hard. Oh. Oh, there we go. There we go. Get it. Okay, so it's when he shoots those ball things at me, I have to hit them back at him. I get it now. Okay, so I can't defend against these. That doesn't do anything. And they're just loud. They're like bottle rockets. Don't. Ah. Okay. Can't do that, but these guys I can go ahead and get rid of, right? And now shoot things at me. Do it. Do it. Oh, that did not go over well, did it? Alright, hold on. Do it again. No! Yes! Boom, 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 boom. Nice. Whoa! There were more of them that time. Oh, there's three. There's three hands. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, gosh. Okay. 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 Dang it. I missed. I missed. How could I be so foolish? Oh, 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 oh. Okay, get ready for the hands. Get ready for the hands. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. One, two, three. And now the guys. There should be four guys, right? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, and four. Okay. Okay. Now shoot. Shoot at me. Shoot at me. Ooh, I hit you twice. Hit you twice, sir. Oh, don't, 
Don't be mad because I'm winning Don't take revenge on me This song is never ending The song is... made me pee? I, I don't know. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Do it. Do it. Come on, I'll, I'll back up a little bit. And hit! Boom! Get him! Get him! Come on! Hurry, 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 hurry! Interesting, watching you swing your axe around like that. I know you'll make a fine specimen. Bad ending. No! Oh, am I going to have to play it through again? You win. <laughs> Thank you, everyone, for watching this episode, this last final episode of Spooky's Jump Scare Mansion with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, Subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at... Whoa. Oh. Out at the end of the video. <laughs> wow. Okay. And you for playing in loving memory of Aurora Pamela Rodriguez. Oh. So as you move the mouse, it does different things. That was awesome. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Love you guys very much. Have a great night, and we'll talk to you very soon. Outro. Want some new merch? Check out teespring.com. Outro.